mangrove belt stretches across the entire coastline of Pakistan, from Kiti Bandar in Sindh to Gwadar in Balochistan. We're off today to explore the mangrove coastline of Sindh. Deltas are an accumulation of sediments at the mouths of rivers where they empty into the basins. One of the largest in the world is located at the mouth of the Indus rivers and spreads across the coast of Sindh. It forms a remarkably uniform landform with large extensive mud flats intervened by narrow creeks which are remnants of old tributaries. This is home to the mangrove forest, just an hour away from the city of Karachi. One can easily catch a boat from any of the coastal fishing villages along the shore. Almost any size of boat is available. Redi Goat is one such spot. The first thing you notice about the village are the hundreds of boats scattered all over the beach area. The next thing you notice are the thousands of eagles perched on rocks as far as the eye can see. It takes a little less than an hour to reach the mudflats and the mangrove forests. At high tide, the trunks are almost completely submerged. As the water ebbs, the full trees become visible. The boat can be parked anywhere near the edge of the flats. Throw in the anchor, a quick jump, wade through the water, struggle through the mud, and the trees are within reach. The mud flat beaches are littered with pointy conical shells, and crabs quickly scurry and hide into mud holes. Mangroves need a mix of seawater and fresh water to flourish. The Indus estuary provides exactly such a mix as the ocean tides enter the river. It is the largest of three major estuaries in Pakistan. Mangrove forests have a thick canopy and an undergrowth of saplings. Now between the island-like mudflats, water channels form and shift and the water levels rise and fall. 